This is the Lock Picking Lawyer, and what I have for you today is the OnGuard Bulldog Bicycle U-Lock. It's the model 8010LM. This lock features an 11mm thick shackle with an opening of roughly 4.5 inches by 9 inches long. That shackle fits into a tubular steel lock body that's only about 50 thousandths of an inch thick, and it doesn't seem to be hardened, which means it can probably be cut with a hacksaw fairly quickly. And while the shackle is well hardened, at only 11 millimeters thick, it is a lightweight compared to many comparable locks. Now the core that secures everything is OnGuard's normal 8 slider to sidebar design. So let's see if we can pick that open. Looking at the bottom, I can fit into that with this Z bar. And then to pick the sliders, I'm going to be using my standard hook in 18 thousandths inserting it sideways and then turning it to lift those sliders. I'm going to start with the left bank of four sliders. Nothing on one. Little click on two. Nothing on three. Four is binding. Got a nice click there. Back to the beginning. Click out of one. Click on two. Nothing on three or four. Click out of one, click on two, nothing on three or four. Not sure what's holding us up here. Click out of one again, click out of two, three, four. Okay, got another click out of one and we dropped into a deep false set, indicating we're probably done with the bank of sliders on the left side. So let's move on to the sliders on the right. One is binding, got a click out of him. Nothing on two, three, four is binding. Got a click out of him and it looks like we are open. Well, I've said it before on these on guard locks, once you figure these cores out, they're really not that difficult to pick. There's nothing technically difficult about them. In any case, that's all I have for you today on this OnGuard Bulldog Bicycle U-Lock, the model 8010LM. If you do have any questions or comments about it, please put them below. If you like this video and would like to see more like it, please subscribe. And as always, have a nice day. Thank you.